We leave you tonight with a new development in wedding ceremonies that go back generations but weren't technically legal until now. In tonight's Indigenous Circle, CTV's Donna Sound on Union. That's the moment. There's a new option to say I do. You start saving the day. The traditional marriage ceremonies Dot Bokash Kennedy has performed for years are now legally recognized in Ontario. Under the new law, she will be the first Indigenous officiant in the province. I just said, wow, that was, uh, that was quite an accomplishment. One that took her over 20 years to achieve. So that's when I first apply, yeah. applied to the Office of the, the Registrar. Office, 1999. Yeah. Because not all people want to go to church or want to get married by a justice of the peace. I don't have a congregation. My congregation is any human being wherever I am, wherever I'm physically at, whether I'm in a building or in the bush. Robert and Kim Stony Point say tying the knot the old way was important to them. We are on the road of revitalizing our own traditions, our own culture, and you know it's been a, you know it's been a struggle, but we're still doing it, and this is one of the small stepping stones. It's about bringing back the culture that was banned and taken away through assimilation and residential schools. A statement released by the province of Ontario said this is a step towards the government's commitment to reconciliation. My dad always told me that uh, God is not in a church. You don't have to go sit in a church. You can go outside, God is around you. And we pledge for uh, bringing us together in a good way. A new choice offering a return to ancestral roots. Donna Sound, CTV News, North Bay, Ontario.